Hello everyone, Omaya back for another One Piece Treasure Cruise video and in this one I'm going to be taking a look at the Pirate King Adventures vs Maha at level 150. Yes, this team can deal with the enemies, gimmicks and also their HP at level 150. The enemy has precisely 900 million HP at that high level and for this team we are making use of Luffy and Yamato's very huge 3.25x all boost and also 2x enemy increased damage taken as well as the support of VV for minus 10% enemy resistance to allow us to kill the enemy at that final stage with the huge amount of HP. So how this team works is we're going to charge our super swap as well as stalling a bit for Nabi and Robin special on stages 1 and 2. So just do what I do, follow what, I, what, I, uh, what I'm doing in the video. It's a bit finicky with Luffy and Yamato's swap effect. Uh, getting them to their full swap effect is a bit finicky. But just be careful and you should be fine. And on stage 3 against Apu here, we're going to use the special of Stasi first for a color affinity. Then Perona to get around the debuffs and give us an attack boost. Uh, they will also carry over into stage 4. And then finally, use the swap effect of Luffy and Yamato, swap into their strength form, and they'll have a Wano Orb. Izo will have a Super Bomb Orb, but don't worry about that. We will be tapping on Izo first to get around the enemy's damage reduction. So make sure you hit a perfect on Izo to get around the damage reduction with his very nice effect in his captain ability. After that, just tap on all of your units, tapping with Luffy and Yamato last with a Super with a Wano Orb, and you will be dealing a lot of damage. Then on stage 4, we're going to take our first turn to kill off uh, King, and then in the, next in the next turn we will kill off Queen. So the enemy does have quite a big uh, barrier, so it's essential that you make sure your friend Captain Izo does have barrier penetration maxed. And how this works is on stage 4, we get 7 turns of paralysis, it goes down to 5 with the support of the Sanji on Luffy and Yamato. Then we can use Nami and Robin to get around the rewind and also the paralysis as well as give us a 2x all boost. This character is super nice for this team, make sure you do have her. And then you can just uh, swap your Luffy and Yamato into their dex form and uh, at this point they should have their super swap fully ready for the next turn where we will go into their strength form with their super swap ability. From there just tap on all the units, make sure you tap on Izo before your Stasi and Luffy and Yamato. Uh, Izo uh, is, does have the barrier penetration, it means he's going to go through the uh, through King's barrier as well as chip away at it, which means that Stasi will be left open and she'll be able to deal a ton of damage at later Pirate King Adventure levels. The second turn, just swap, super swap your Luffy and Yamato into strength, they'll have a 1 orb, we'll have a 2.5s color affinity, and uh, from there just tap on all of your units. Uh, you do have blindness, uh, unfortunately. Don't worry about that for the final stage. We don't have to worry about tapping because we will have Sugar's Toy Bears effect. But on stage 4, yeah, just try to hit at least greats. Uh, you can just go into a, a training forest to try and practice your taps with this team if you are a bit paranoid. But it should be fine. The damage is safe and just kill very nice on stage 4. Also, uh, Queen's Barrier will, will be gone, so you don't have to worry about getting through that. Then on the final stage, we'll have to deal with a bunch of stuff. We'll use Stasi Special again, she should be ready if you did everything like I did. Uh, use her to get around the Special Bind, Despair, and give us a Color Affinity Boost. There will be one turn of Despair left, which is why we have the support of Kuma on our Perona. Then you can use the Special of your Izo to give us 1 Orbs, a Chain Growth Rate Boost, and a Base Attack Boost. Then use Izo's super class to get around the enemy's defense up and give the enemy resistance down. VV support will get around the last turn of threshold uh, that we need and then also get around, uh, I mean give the enemy minus 10% resistance down. Finally use Luffy and Yamato for all boost and enemy increased damage taken and then sugar and change everyone into toy bears besides Luffy and Yamato. Tap on Sugar and then hit on Luffy and Yamato last. Izo should get around the last turn of the threshold when he taps and that'll be it for the team. As you can see here, uh, Izo does 230 million, 230 million damage uh, with no boost. I don't have any special map effects that is helping me with damage. So that's it for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you have any questions about the team, ask them down below. But with all that being said, if you did enjoy, make sure to like and subscribe for more content like this in the future. And I'll see you guys within the next video.